In this video, we're going to learn how to calculate the area of a rectangle using Python. The first thing we'll do is prompt the user to enter the width and the length of the rectangle. So we'll have length is equal to float input length colon. And we'll also have width is equal to float input. And we'll have width colon. So what we're doing here is using the input function to prompt the user with the text length colon. So the user will be told to enter the length. They'll enter in the length and the string that they enter will be returned from the input function. Float is gonna take that and turn it into a float. We're gonna store that into length. And we do the exact same thing with width. Now that we have the rectangle length and width, we can calculate the rectangle area. So we'll have area is equal to length times width. Then we can print out the rectangle area with print area colon and area. So the print function will print out the text area colon followed by the actual computed area. So we can save this and try out our program and we'll enter in a length of let's say five and a width of four and we get an area of 20 and that is correct. So our program is working correctly. If we try our program again and this time enter in a length of 2.333333 and a width of 9.8888 Eight, eight. We now get this very long area. Perhaps we don't need that many decimal digits of accuracy. We could actually round the number down to a fewer amount of decimal places using round. So we could pass the result of the calculated area to the round function as its first argument. And the second argument to the round function would be the number of decimal digits that we do want. We could say four. So we could save this and then try our program again. And now if we enter in a length of 2.333333 and a width of 9.888888, we now get this area that's been rounded to four decimal digits of accuracy. If our program needs to calculate the area of a rectangle in multiple places in the source code, we'd probably not wanna reproduce this same expression again and again. We could make a mistake if we tried to do that, Instead, we'd probably have a function to calculate the area of a rectangle. And that could look like this. We could copy this and we'll say def rectangle underscore area. And the function will have two parameters, the length, which we'll have as L, and the width, which we'll have as W. And we'll calculate the rectangle area the same as we did before. This time, we're going to return the result of this expression and we'll replace length with the parameter name L and width with the parameter name W. Then down here, we can call the function rectangle area and we'll pass it length and width as arguments. So we can save this and try this new version of the program out. And if we enter in the same length and width as before, we'll get the same result as before, 23.0741. So this is how we can calculate the area of a rectangle using Python. Check out PortfolioCourses.com, where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers.